the global development community's attention continues to be focused on a number of ongoing humanitarian crises, which have taxed resources and required a rapid, coordinated, concerted response. The U.S. Agency for International Development, for the first time in its 50-plus year history, is responding to four simultaneous humanitarian disasters. In West Africa, the Ebola virus continues to spread and to outpace the international community's efforts to contain it, as well as national governments' health systems. Thursday, the World Health Organization announced that the virus could eventually afflict more than 20,000 people throughout the West African countries currently affected, which is roughly seven times the number of current cases in the three West African countries most affected. At DevX, we've reported on the important role that civil society leaders have to play in communicating accurate and timely information to communities that may be quarantined or where Ebola treatment centers may be established to treat patients afflicted. Aid donors continue to commit resources to South Sudan and to Syria, and in Iraq we've heard from relief workers who are struggling to access funding quickly enough to respond to the urgent needs presented by internally displaced peoples. This situation is complicated by the fact that U.S. assistance agencies in particular are facing the nearing end of their fiscal year, and it remains to be seen how that fiscal pressure could play out in terms of the response capabilities. We're tracking a number of upcoming events, including World Water Week in Stockholm next week, the UN Climate Change Summit in New York in early September, and of course the UN General Assembly also in New York in September. DevX will have a full media presence to keep tabs on the huge variety of discussions, goals, debates, and decisions likely to emerge from the UN General Assembly. Global leaders will converge to reshape the global development agenda and set the goals that will replace the Millennium Development Goals. The increasing influx of Central American children across the US-Mexico border, what some are calling a border crisis, has amplified voices calling for a migration goal to be part of the post-2015 agenda. Discussions could focus on removing barriers to remittances and investment by global diaspora groups interested in giving back to their countries of origin. At DevX, we'll continue to track these and other global priorities and to keep tabs on the breaking news that affects our community every day.